Hi everyone! Uh, so I wanted to do something a little bit different today. Um, I've been putting together a little gift box for a friend of mine from the Czech Republic. I'm going to Brussels tomorrow to meet up with her for the first time and I've, I've kind of put her a little little parcel together with some really good things in it. Um, all of them are, have been obviously bought in Germany from the supermarket or from the, the drugstore. And she told me that she was having problems getting stuff in Czech Republic. Vegan things um, aren't so readily, readily available as they are here. So I thought I'd show you guys what I put together for her and uh, I hope she likes it. I'm really excited. So, this is the box. Um, yeah, you're probably thinking how is she going to get that home? But she has a friend that's uh, driving all the way back to the Czech Republic from Brussels. So there's no problem there. So I'll get right into it. First thing that I got her is some uh, chocolate. It's from iChoc, I think this was about $1.99. It's bad that I'm saying the prices, she might watch this, doesn't matter. You're worth every penny. Um, this is $1.99, uh, absolutely fucking amazing. I've tried this myself, it's a bit addictive, it's a bit dangerous, but yeah. I got this from the shop literally across the road. Everywhere is stocking this shit now, so there's no excuse. Uh, then uh, I kind of got her a little bit of everything, like things that she'll need. Uh, then I got her this uh, disinfection spray. This is kind of like just for surfaces and worktops and everything like that. It's against bacteria and stuff like that. You can use it in your bathroom, toilet, carpet, wherever, shoes. So yeah, I think that's always a really handy thing to have. And this is from um, a drugstore here called DM. Um, and all of their, all of their, um, what's it fucking called? Oh my god, all of their own brand stuff. Own brand stuff is um, not tested on animals. Uh, I don't know if it's all vegan, but that is definitely. Okay, so what next? Also from DM. They do a lot of food stuff in this drugstore, funnily enough. Also from DM is this veggie salami. I've actually never tried it because I'm not really into that. I'm not really into a lot of soya stuff. Um, and um, I never like the taste of sausage or anything like that, even when um, I, I did eat meat. So yeah, uh, then I got her a hair mask. It's from Alverde, it's got uh, argan oil in it and um, almond, awesome, I've tried that as well, works on my hair, obviously not used it today. Okay, uh, then I got her an, an Alverde um, shower gel, that's definitely also vegan, um, yeah, it smells amazing, it's cardamom and vanilla, oh my god, I fucking eat it, but I won't. Then um, the lady at DM, when I was there, she actually gave me some uh, free little soaps, which I thought were really cute. I didn't really want to keep them, but I think they're so cute to just give to someone as a present. And they could be really handy when you're traveling. So this one's with lavender. And this one is with lemon and lime. And oh, I can just smell them through the packaging. It's so good. I think these are organic as well. I love Alberta. It's the best. Okay, then what else did I get from DM? Oh, she's really into tea, so I got her some, obviously most tea is vegan. I think all tea is vegan. How can, how can tea not be vegan? Write in the comments. Um, this is uh, a herbal tea. Um, yeah, it's like a, a natural, it's called a nat natural tea. Um, yeah, it's got no shit in it basically. It's all organic. Um, 100% natürliche Kräutertee, der ganz ohne zusätzliche Aromen, einen wunderbaren Geschmack nach frischen und milden Kräutern entfaltet. Genießen das pure Geschmackserlebnis. That's all I'm gonna say. Right, what's next? Oh, also from uh, DM are these burgers. And they are Mexican style burgers with beans and corn and stuff in them. They take about seven minutes to cook on, in a pan. They're really, really good. And these are vegan as well. And can you, you can also get, um, I think there's an Italian style one. Yeah, I really like these ones. Those are really, really good. What else did I get from the end? Oh, uh, some deodorant. Everybody needs deodorant. I'm not saying you stink, Elizabeth, but everybody needs it. Uh, yeah, it's got, sorry about that, it's got, um, no silicone, parabens, uh, colorants, or 
animal derived ingredients and no per se aluminium it's got no animal, aluminium in it either and she's really into a sort of natural um more natural stuff and this is really good i've got this myself and it smells well really really good it's orange that's from cd by the way if i didn't already say <coughs> okay little cappuccino soya cappuccino organic it says on the front vegan uh, i've never had this because i don't drink coffee and um i never liked cappuccinos and stuff like that anyway so yeah hopefully she will though next uh God, most of this stuff is actually from DM. Then I got her an Alverda shampoo. Yeah, for... Yeah, it's just like a general care. Nutri-care shampoo. It's good for your hair. Then, what else did I get? Oh, I thought this was really cute. And then when I, when I bought it, I was like... I don't I actually don't know how I feel about buying that. Because it's, um, it's like pasta, but it's in the shape of little farm animals. I don't like that it says that it's farm animals on the front, but I kind of wanted to make it a little joke and be like, this is the only way that animals should be eaten. Um, but yeah, the little pastas, they are vegan. They've got little retarded pictures of pigs and stuff on the front. But yeah, they're completely vegan. And yeah, I think, I think it's cute if you're vegan and you, set, and you do stuff like that because... They, they are really cute, the little things, and it is the only only way you should ever eat anything. It should only look like an animal, it shouldn't be an animal. That's the weirdest thing I've ever said. It shouldn't even look like an animal. I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay. I got her a little card. I won't read it to you because it's really cute, but... It says friendship, and it's got a little beagle on the front, and I've got a beagle. Um, I wrote her a little something in the back, because she's a really good friend. Oh! This I must show you. This is also from DM and it's better than Nut Nutella. You heard it from me. It's better than Nutella. It's nut, uh, nut and nugget vegan chocolate spread. You get loads of it as well. It's like 400 grams. Uh, does it actually say? Yeah, it does say vegan on the front there. It's 400 grams. It's so good. Like Alex eats so much of this shit. And when I used to eat a lot of high fat stuff, I used to eat a lot of it as well. So be careful because it's fucking addictive. What else? Okay. Oh. Tortellini. So, this is tortellini with vegetables in it. It's organic. Um, it's got, let's have a look. Onions, uh, carrots, leek, celery, spinach, um, potato, salt, uh, garlic, pepper, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it's really, really good. Really nice with the pasta sauce or even on its own actually, we took this to a festival and we had it with like a pasta sauce and everybody wanted some of it. Uh, yeah, our, our, our food always looked better at the festival. Everybody always asked us what we had because we were really well well prepared. Uh, even though the festival we went to does have vegan options, we took a lot of stuff with us because I'm a cheap, cheapskate and I know that sometimes people can put the prices up if they've got vegan food there. Um, so yeah, definitely recommend that. Uh, what else? Oh, these little fruit snacks from the go, ridiculously overpriced, but I think they're cute and they're nice if you're traveling and they are called Nature Addicts fr Fruit Snack. They're completely vegan. They are 100% fruit. It's just raspberries. Ah, that's cool. She'll like that, definitely. Uh, yeah, it's just fruit. And what else? No, it literally is just fruit. Cool. So yeah. They are yummy, I've had these before as well, they just taste like sweets. You could give easily give these to kids and they wouldn't they wouldn't even detect that they were eating fruit. Though they should be, they should be loving it. Okay, is that everything from DM? Oh, toothpaste. Yeah, it's from DM's own mark and it's vegan. Um, what else? Just a nail polish from DM. This is from Essence. Uh, yeah, so that's everything from DM. Now, uh, I'm to, I got, oh, she's got two dogs. Um, she doesn't give them vegan food. Yeah. I think she's wanting to switch them to a vegan diet, but I just wanted to give something to the dogs anyway. And because I, my dogs are vegan, so, um, we only have, we only buy stuff, for, I would never buy meat. Um, so I got her these little snack biscuits. 
which Benny and Lena absolutely adore. They are from Yara and they've got seaweed and spirulina. What the fuck is that? <laughs> don't even know what that is. Uh, yeah, basically they're organic. There's no shit in them and dogs fucking love them. And um, we buy a big box of these and uh, we use it for training. I say training very loosely because our dogs can be quite naughty and they don't really listen. Uh, but yeah, they really, really like these. Highly recommend them, buy them. Amazon, you can get them off Amazon. Okay, uh, what else have we got? Oh, so I, I nipped to one of the health food stores um, in town the other day and uh, I was just looking around. I usually don't buy a lot of stuff from there because, just because it's so expensive and I'm such a cheapskate. But, um, oh. uh, yeah, I don't buy a lot of stuff from there because I'm just a cheapskate. But I did find a couple of things that I wanted to give to her as a gift. Um, and I also got Alex one, which was white chocolate nugget, but that got demolished long ago. So you're not even going to see that. So I got this black cherry um, chocolate. It is from Vivani. And it says on it, yeah, it's vegan. Um, yeah, it's um, dark chocolate with um, sour cherry pieces in it smells really good so yeah she'll probably, it's a little bit small but the thing is stuff in health food stores is so overpriced and I think that's the problem that she has in the Czech Republic I can imagine that the only vegan food you can really get I say vegan vegan processed food or vegan like burgers and stuff like that I imagine that it's only in health food stores and health food stores rip you off a lot so yeah then for, also from the health food store this was really cheap uh, I use this in all of my like a lot of my smoothies when I have uh, bananas and dates. I like to put vanilla powder in there as well. Sorry, I just burped. Um, this is bourbon vanilla. It is yeah, just really simple. There's a lot of design on this front. It's a pretty simple product. Yeah, it's uh, organic, vegan. Yeah, it's it's just vanilla chopped up. It's like a powder. Really good though. Okay, so. The last place I went to was Rewe, which is like a little shop here, like a little supermarket. You can get everything in there, and you can get so much more than I that I'm gonna than I'm gonna show here. But um, yeah, this is what I got her from there. These um, Mana wafer biscuits. Um, they're an Austrian brand, I think, and yeah, they're like a hazelnut wafer, and they're really really yummy. Alex really loves these as well. So. What else? The last thing I got, and this is also from Raven, I had to really stop myself because I really wanted to buy her a lot more stuff just because she's such a lovely person. Um, yeah, I just I just wanted to completely spoil her, but like I had to stop myself because it's just going to be awkward for to try and get it all home. And I've got not got a bigger basket than this. Um, so yeah, the last thing is this uh, pasta sauce. It's just a bolognese sauce from Reva, the place that I just said. It's organic, it's vegan, it's absolutely delicious it goes really well with the tortelloni as well and yeah i really really like this stuff so yeah that is it um yeah if you want me to do any more hauls or anything like that let me know in the comments down below um also thinking of doing some videos in german but i'm a little bit yeah it's a bit weird um i'll i, I might i might consider doing some german videos because yeah, I live here and I speak it every day, so I, sh I really should. Um, as well, we're doing the halls. I should really do it in German because, yeah, if you don't live here in, in these, it's not very relevant as these things aren't readily available for you. So yeah, thank you for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it, and I'll see you in the next video.